Hey guys, it's Roman. Just wanted to do a quick video of this 2022NX F Sport 1 package. So this is the entry level for an X350 F uh, series. And the main idea why I'm doing this video is uh, to show you guys how it looks like. And uh, the main uh, reason also um, would be because this car has nine inch uh, touchscreen rather than your 14 inch uh, touchscreen in the upper trim level. So I want to show you guys the comparison of the size and uh, tell you guys how it looks like, how to operate it. Is nine, nine inch screen uh, good enough? Is it too small? Let's find out. But let's just uh, hop in the car. This one we have was a uh, red interior. Now you're gonna have um, the same digital dash for the F Sport. Oh, it's hopping. All right, hopefully you guys can see it so that my camera catches on nicely. Let's start it up. Starts right up. So this is how the nine inch screen looks like for the size wise. Um, essentially, trying to get my focus on the on the screen so you guys can see a little bit better but um, so definitely a little bit smaller um, it's still fairly big like it's not small at all like this is my hand so it's good like iPad mini size at least uh, we still have our knobs for the climate um, heated steering wheel heated cold uh, ventilated seats uh, still in the car so we have uh, music phone connectivity uh, vehicle information uh, navigation as well so pretty cool and that 14 inch screen you're gonna have this uh, start button around here and the screen is gonna start from here and up to about this edge as well. So it's just gonna be wider, really. I don't think there's much difference in the height of the screen, which is kind of nice. But essentially, uh, so you guys have an idea, this is how it's going to look like. Then we go into the climate, um, the fan speed. The fa this is nice, it's uh, quite as, just as responsive as the other one, which is uh, pretty cool. So I don't think there is different um, programming used for the smaller screen, which is also nice to have because, um, you know, this is the lower trim over, so it's a little bit cheaper car, a little bit more budget oriented. This main screen looks about the same no difference that I can uh, I can see and so of course it's brand new so it's full redesign of the dash we have these buttons on the steering wheel as well they're programmable everything's automatic of course and for the F Sport Series 1 we have the smaller sunroof so not the full size Still fairly large. But anyway, let me know what you guys uh, think. If you have any questions, like and subscribe for more content. And I'll see you guys in the next video.